Thank you very much. I will speak uh, first of all about uh, the London market. As you know, the London market is one of the most uh, attractive market in entire Europe. As attracted the last uh, uh, two, three years, uh, kind of uh, seven billion of acquisition. If you remember, and recently uh, there was uh, so much, there was some problem even about uh, that that uh, kind of demand since. Uh, uh, there was so much asking of uh, uh, even office and uh, uh, residential that uh, uh, the problem was that there was a, 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 a uh, we go to the slides of the numbers as you see the numbers of the, the availability rate is very low 5.3 means that uh, is a, a, there is a very low vacancy. Basically, everything uh, building that is uh, ready uh, stay on the market three six months and uh, has to be rented. And uh, it depends uh, in what part of the city, but the, the rents are quite uh, good. Uh, and uh, 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 if you see, there are also some example of uh, recent uh, 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 deals. And uh, uh, Google, like Ernest Young, uh, make uh, a kind of uh, uh, example where uh, all the other uh, competitors follow uh, the price and the requirement. So it's a, it's a quite interesting market. You see uh, that it can vary from 110,000, 110, 110 uh, pounds uh, to. 45 uh, per square feet and uh, basically uh, there is an average about 50. So uh, it's a very high if you compare with other market in, like in Europe but it's incredible in a good shape. So that is mean that real estate uh, is not only depend on price, but it depend on location. It is also something that uh, is familiar with all the real estate men. You say location, location, location. London so far has been one of the best places to, to invest. As attract investments for from uh, uh, all, all part of Europe. If you see how much is uh, that investment, as I said before, is the most. 7 billion of euro in 2014 and uh, this is a huge amount if you speak about uh, this kind of numbers just london is uh, similar to what you can find uh, uh, almost in not entire italy so it's a, it's a very little market is a niche but which is able to attract a huge amount of investments so we, we speak about uh, almost uh, 2, 2 billion of investment in south bank uh, with uh, a yields uh, about 6.1. So uh, it's, um, it's a quite a good also return, like on investments. It's a, it's a city that is, um, I think, unique. Maybe only Paris and, Ber and Berlin and some other cities in uh, Germany can be kind of similar but this is one of the most attractive place if you see also the difference in two um, uh, it's a it's a oh, there has been an increase to 2.28 million and uh, 2013 3, 3.35 with an increase and in, and the last uh, report say that also the 2015 started quite well uh, this is a, this is a this is a, I want to go to Germany. That is a, a place that I think is a quite uh, attractive. Uh, Germany totally the different uh, 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 countries. It's not like London, since there is not only one town. There are many towns. They are quite uh, similar. There is not to, there is not only. Uh, Berlin, there is not only Fra Frankfurt, basically in Germany there are many capital and that, that is something that you have to consider. Sometimes they, they, the investor look more for Berlin, but 
Berlin, as you see from the numbers, is not always uh, the most uh, uh, excited place to, to invest. Uh, but in any case, uh, uh, the, 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 the total investment in 2013 was 30 billion of euro, which was huge. Please take note that the, the, the German market is very well structured for funds. So the funds is one of the most big element to make this kind of numbers. Uh, why Germany? As you know, is a very solid economic fundamentals. Is a so sophisticated and highly liquid investment because there are many funds. Uh, there are many, there are strong occupational fund, fund, fundamental, so the work is there, the people go where to open factory and uh, open office, so they are able to, to uh, guarantee long term yields and, sta and stability. Please note that the German market is one of the few in Europe that is, uh, has been affected, but not so much from, from the crisis, has been uh, a little bit uh, turned down, but very, very <coughs> small. Ireland, I think, is uh, very far away from here, so I will uh, like uh, jump Ireland. I will go back to Italy. Italy is where I come from. Uh, the, 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 most, uh, uh, the most important towns are Rome and Milan. Uh, is where basically uh, the, the average of the price of the office go from for 400 to 500 uh, uh, euro per, per square meter per month, and uh, um, there are also other towns, but as you see, as totally a different market. Just Milan and Rome are able to keep uh, their performance as, uh, as uh, the Rome and Milan. So, uh, but if you see, uh, if you need uh, to structure a client, you can also uh, understand where it needs uh, to open office because the, the office in Italy can vary a lot from town. You can also spend very few few money in non, in, in, like in other cities. The, the investment deals uh, are around six six percent. It's not much, but uh, uh, is a quite stable market, and there are uh, um, there have been a. a Maybe in the 2011, 2012, some problem of occupancy, but today the office is quite well uh, let, so it's a good market. Poland, I don't know if you are interested in Poland. I will uh, just touch a little bit of Romania. Like Romania, maybe you know, it's the main, the main town is, is Bucharest, and, uh, and also is the town where basically the, the rent are the higher 18, 19 per square meters uh, per, per, per month. Uh, so I, as you see, you, Europe is big and the price of uh, the office change a lot. Uh, and this is also a big why people is looking for relocate uh, office from one part of Europe to others. It, it also, I think, is a, is a very good uh, option for, for Croatia. And uh, because uh, today, the, uh, especially the big multinational uh, company are uh, quite uh, uh, opportunistic. So they move office quite easily from, from city to, to city. Um, uh, and uh, this is why I think you need to take a care also of uh, what is going on in the other part of Europe, because especially big, big company can open office years, and uh, in, two, in two years time open uh, in Romania or in uh, Hungary. And uh, what you can also do is um, to try to uh, have uh, the numbers and the capability to follow your client in, in, in the jurisdiction. This is something that you need to keep uh, in mind, especially if you speak with the big clients, that they have to opt where, where to go and how to, to go. So thank you very much, and uh, I, I will um, give you any other answer at the end if you need. Hvala gospodinu Kampanjoliju, malo smo regiju proširili, to ste shvatili, malo se širimo.